things as they prove their worth. Now, one of the biggest things that we've found here is that we can continuously produce compost with chickens. So we've got a downhill chicken composting system where the compost is continuously turned downhill and comes out at the bottom here. So we have these doors that open and release the compost. Every week, one cubic meter pops out. One cubic meter of material goes in the top and comes through the system. This is the engine of the fertility of the site. And we've put a bed of frame on, we've put a grapevine trellis over the top, no grapes yet, they'll be coming. And we've shaded it more, but we've done something very special. We've built the rabbit system onto the other end of it. They were together, but they weren't connected. Now we have rabbit manure linked to chicken manure linked to the compost and the fertility of the site. So we're producing eggs, we're producing chicken meat, and we're producing rabbit meat. We've got both manures co-mingled, and together we bring in mulch and food scraps from the village, and we can actually increase the number of rabbits, and we can increase the number of chickens. So come on in, and I'll show you what it's like. So we've developed a, a, a larger perch which is hinged and we can take it out of the way. And the organic matter sits underneath the perch and they manure onto it. And that goes down and makes the first compost on the way down the hill. Now in here, we're connected directly. Come on round this way. We're connected directly to our rabbits. And this rabbit house, it's got baby mothers, mother and baby chickens in here too. This rabbit house is below ground. I'm already below ground and it's a lot cooler. And there's a hole here with about 30 rabbits down there. They're actually underground. Starting from this point, it's already underground, below, below ground level. They're going further underground and living in the cool. We feed them here. They manure mostly here and we clean this out and bring it through underneath the roost, add it to the compost with food scraps, and there it goes tumbling down the hill. One turn a week, five weeks later, it pops out the other end. As long as we make a new one each week, we get a brand new compost out the other end. Three new eggs here laid this afternoon. There's fresh eggs arriving all the time. So we've got a productive fertilizer creation